Uh, one of the things that's influenced my art and where it's going is the experience I've had working with elders, particularly female elders. Um, early in my artistic career, I got exposed to some of the traditional arts. Uh, while I was just starting to reawake, um, learn this uh, visual art and uh, get the skills to do it. And as I was going through developing my, my painting life, I was getting traditional teachings about moss bags and how to raise babies and the old way that the women were with children. And so one of the things when I started my painting, uh, I was learning these moss bag teachings. And a moss bag is the way we used to carry and raise our babies so that they would feel security and bonding and love. And I was learning uh, how to make them. Do, um, this particular moss bag is one that I made. I did all the beadwork. I sewed it. Um, I was mentored and taught how to make it by a really good friend who'd learned from a Cree elder named Mary Lee, who carries the teachings of the moss bag. And so she, learning from uh, elders like Mary Lee and uh, some of the other women in my life, I learned to make these traditional moss bags and I gathered, um, was gifted with all these beautiful teachings. And what happened is these moss bag teachings, the nurturing, how to care for babies, how to bring them and welcome them into the world, to keep them safe, to help them feel nurturing. All these things I was learning through the moss bag teachings, I started to put into my painting practice. So a lot of people will see a lot of the moss bags represented in my visual art, and they don't realize that there is just so much meaning attached. When a moss bag is presented in my art, it means so much more to me than what meets the eye. And so today I actually have do a lot of workshops to bring the moss bag making out. And I've done workshops with Wabano Centre for Aboriginal Health and some other women's groups and community groups. And here's a picture of one of the um, posters that the Wabano Centre for Aboriginal Health um, made of, we did a moss bag waking workshop for new moms who just had babies. So this is one of our, our moms and she, this is her baby, her newborn baby. And she learned, she made that moss bag in our workshop and she got all the beautiful teachings and she's applying it and what she learned in her life. And we've had a really good response from the women to bring this back. So who would have thought, hey, the art, and it's done so much more for me and as a, as a developing my, my parenting and, and contributing to my community. The other thing that, I'm gonna just sit the baby here. The other thing that's really common in my visual art practice is this, it's a cradle board. And we had this in our family and a lot of kids were carried in cradle boards. And so the moss bag would slip in and here's actual a moss bag located in there, another one that the baby would be wrapped up and then the baby would be put in the cradle board to see and learn, learn how to observe the world around them before they were um, able to interact with it. So I'm really happy that um, we're bringing the teachings back and I know that my art has raised a lot of questions about what are these things in the art? What are these symbols that you're using? And so I'm really happy to have these beautiful teachings incorporated into my artistic practices and I do workshops now to make sure that this stuff, this valuable stuff is, is passed on to our communities and to our parents today.